Hey guys, MSA here, and welcome back to my LP. Uh, so, um, I had an idea this episode to set up some more quarries because, as you can see, I've got a decent amount of uh, fuel now, uh, thanks to that power cable there. Although, um, I had a kind of a little bit of an issue, and uh, it was due to the chunk loader. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently. Um, no, no, I'm getting a second opinion on this, but I think one of my engines may have exploded. <laughs> yeah, it did. Uh, I collected all the resources that I could, and uh, yeah, one of them did explode. And let me scratch my ear. Sorry about that. Um, but yeah, one one of them definitely exploded, and um, I think I know why. Um, I did kind of a bit of stuff off camera. I actually. I'm not sure if I showed you this or not, but I've extended the water pipe, so now I've got plenty of water pumps pumping into here, um, and I can still turn them all on and off. Uh, there are still some issues with water getting sucked up. That was always an issue. It's never seemed to ever go away. Uh, but that's not what worries me right now. Um, what happened was is that. Um, the no matter how much water I know I know there's missing water there and you're all probably going to go oh was it did it not blow up because those are gone so they're not getting that much water no that's not the issue and uh, the issue is is that the pumps that were on this side never no matter how much uh, water I put into the system they never really got that much out of it if you know what I mean so they always seem to uh, be getting really uh, red and the chunk loader kept that chunk open at all times and that pretty much meant that uh, it blew up which is kind of a shame uh, so I need to think through how I'm going to separate out the water uh, more carefully in the future although I'm just going to fix up this room again because it got pretty badly messed up <laughs> um, so I'll see you in a mo yeah so I've got this place pretty much sorted out again and I did not mean to do that at all uh, what I meant to do was, uh, if I get it this, I meant to place it like that. Yeah, that makes more sense. Uh, now I need to check, what was the transmission frequency in this? 16 apparently. So let's uh, switch this back to 16. Uh, 16. It's thundering outside. Okay, so that should have the water pump going again. Yep, it's all pumping very well. And uh, now let's uh, get this going again. Uh, I, I don't want to go as overboard as I did last time, because I think that was the issue. I just did too many machines with too many water things pumping into it. So I have three remaining from everything that happened. And actually, I'd quite like to... Yeah, this is where they were last time, because this is the where I put my line of redstone um, I like to get back up here as well and uh, what I want to do is uh, what what's the power from up here set to oh I need to fix that up uh, the power turn that off for now uh, the power from here is set to 18 good so uh, 18 is then the magic number and uh, then I can very simply just switch uh, a transmitter up here to 18 as well do I have any uh, redstone on me? yeah do, yeah it kept the redstone good um, now what I need to do is uh, break these blocks as well and put these like this and then attach my line of redstone like that uh, and I want to here put my transmitter uh, or no sorry receiver and flip it around there we go set it to 18 and that should be it and uh, get out of here do, 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 do. Go and uh, now I should be able to place these like boom. 
Boop. And oh no, I need no, <laughs> I need one more space. Uh, you know what? I don't really, because I can just do it like that. And uh, I think the wooden pipes may have got destroyed. Uh, one of them remains still, I guess. Uh, I need to get some more of those back in a sec. Yeah, and uh, got the pipes now. Uh, so, oh, I do need to. Hmm. Okay, no, it should be fine actually, because if I just set it with a wrench, oh, please tell me I have my wrench in here. Yeah, very good. Um, it should be fine. I just need to set this up a little differently. Uh, so if I set it so my wrench is like that, and then uh, have it so that the conduct pipes here uh, go like this, and then I have the power teleport pipe right here. There we go, and again, the magic number for this is six or five, even. And I don't want it to receive, obviously. And uh, I've lost all the fuel in these as well, which is a shame. Uh, now, let's touch the water to these. Uh, do I have any? Uh, I have some. Uh, I have a total of five. Do you think that'll be enough? Let's check. Okay, six actually, if you include that one. So, yeah, yeah, I have enough. That's fine then. Okay, so the water should flow down that, and I'm hoping three should be enough to power my uh, base, or at least the majority of it. And uh, everything should be back up to speed now, which is cool and dandy. Um, I need more wood for that back wall, don't I? Uh, got plenty of it in here. That's good. There we go. Let's see how well that's filling up. Ah, oh, yeah, it's filling up nicely. And this far, far one's uh, filling up all right. And this one again, all right. Uh, see, it's those ones I'm going to be worried about for overheating because I think that's that was the issue that happened last time. It's just too far away to receive. Um, enough so what I'm thinking I might do instead is actually put the pipe on the other side um, if you know what I mean so receive these again and uh, put this here that there too many items on me so if I do that and set it to uh, whoops, no, what I want to do was 18, and then, there we go, oops, um, now we want to uh, make sure that everything is here. That, that should work now, I think. Uh, I'm going to have to move this pipe as well, obviously. There we go. And I want to... Here. Nope, nope, can't reach it. Um, oh well, I'll get that later. Oh, do you know what I can do? I can use the nifty item trick. Or nifty block trick, you know where the blocks go boom like that. <laughs> that works. And uh, there we go. Now, it... okay, I just wasted one pipe there, but you know what? I don't care. <laughs> I've just given up all caring. Um. No, actually, I shouldn't because I need to get that on the other side. <laughs> oh, it's so annoying doing all this. Uh, it's not even the doing it that's annoying. It's just the fact that it blew up and I have to do it again. Oh, I didn't need to. Uh, there we go. And uh, these should now fill up with water. 
and that's much better much better yeah that's what I wanted and that's set 5 uh, so now I should be able to I'm just going to leave portal like right there and I'm going to clear this up actually just because it's going to annoy me um, put another portal here power on oh of course there's no fuel in them <laughs> forgot that uh, I'm just going to I'll put one bucket full of fuel each I guess blue can you extract fuel like directly from it? That'd be kind of handy. Well, yeah, like uh, if you know what I mean, like through the portal. There we go. This is just going to quicken everything up a tiny bit. I don't think I doubt you can, but you know. Just get enough fuel. I'll just like do one fuel per thing. Uh, why are they not turning on now? Is the redstone wire below them on? No, it's not because I'd done that for some reason. I have no idea how that happened. This should work now. There we go. Yeah, so they're producing plenty of power now. Cool. And um, let's see. Yep, that's all working again. Everything is working fine. And um, obviously, I don't want too much on. But there we go. Um, and I don't think overheating should be too much of an issue anymore. So, uh, what I want to do, and uh, which was something I wanted to do originally in this episode, was to get plenty of more quarries set up. And I want to set them up over there a little bit, a bit further away. What? Are we not in the desert right now? Maybe I'm not quite in it yet. Oh yeah, there I am. A minute now. There we go. I was wondering how it was raining in the desert. <laughs> um, there we go. So I was thinking quarry would be good if I set them up right here. Excuse the lag. Sorry, I'm trying to render out some uh, videos of Thomcraft too. Because yeah, I started up at that season again. Um, but I'm actually going to wait on holiday tomorrow, so I'm trying to get like three episodes each made. Um, so that's why today's going to be very talky. A lot of these episodes have been very talky, so I think it's just going to be a talky season. Um, but anyway, yeah, so here is where I want it to be, definitely. Um, the different spawners right here. Or the, di the different quarries, even. And I've got actually six of them ready right now. And... Uh, I uh, won't be able to get all six of them done just now. But there we go. So one, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four, five. There we go. That's what I want. And uh, I guess I'll do the same right here. Not like that, though. Why is it not facing me? Um, maybe I need to go there we go that's what I want um, the same oh I was about to say the same there but well it's just sand I guess so it should be fine um, you know I'm not really missing out too much I'll build a border around that uh, at some point but let's get those started so par 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 and uh, then item, item. I want I want to get all the items set up first of all because um, in past experience, like you know, you lose a tiny bit of items. Oops. You know, I just put all the power pipes down and uh, or the teleport pipes down actually, and then I'll fine tune them afterwards. Or should I? 
No, actually, no, I guess it would be more wise just to do the, these ones first. Because then they'll start mining out everything. And also setting up the general system. I realized I forgot to select that one and this one. There we go. So let's get this all set up. There we go. Is that five? Yeah. And five. There we go. Uh, so these should now start uh, mining everything out. Let's t check this one. If it works for this one, it should work for all of them. And it's quite slow because I'm not producing too much power right now um, because obviously I restricted a lot of my power consumption recently for reasons you all know. Um, yeah, there we go. So there's the sand going through into 5. And if we head back, uh, I probably should get like an auto spawner thing set up here because it's going to be hard to get back all the way from there every time. There we go, I think that's a hit, yep. You know, it's going to be annoying doing that every time, so I might just set up an auto spawner portal thing. Uh, or I might even have a teleporter in this room to it. Um, but to save stuff, I'm going to, I guess, turn off the refinery. So I won't use any power then for it. Um, and. Have a look at this. Uh, they should be going well. Uh, the best way to check is if they're using up the, all their water, which they're not. So that's good. So that shows that um, they're not really going to be overheating too much. I might add some more. Um, I'm tempted to, but I'm also tempted not to because I don't want another explosion. That was not fun at all. Um, also, what I want is and I need another Tesla coil thing. Or tell no what Tesla coil? Did I say? Te did I really just say Tesla coil? Um, did not mean to say that. Um, but what happened here was I actually had the chunk loader right there, and I've got another one where my other quarries were, and I'm gonna uh, move that one over there. Let's check first of all this works. Yep, that one's working. It blew up in the explosion, obviously. But I what am I doing? I, I don't know. I'm just weird. There we go. And um, what I was going to say was that the other one is over there. And I can remove that now because I don't need it. I think, or less, did I remove it? Oh no, I think I may have already actually removed it. Yeah, I did. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to need to make one then. That's not really an issue. They're not too expensive. Uh, go make one. And you'll be there too. Oh, but that may be an issue. If you leave an unloaded chunk, uh, the coil stuff. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm just about. I'm just thinking about this. If you actually leave an unloaded chunk, uh, the these pipes here actually despawn just due to a bug. So uh, what I'm going to do is this isn't really cheating, really. Uh, what I'm going to do is oh, I'm already on this mode. <laughs> That's handy. Uh, oh yeah, I was doing some stuff. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and I'm going to spawn in one of these guys, teleport tethers. There we go. And I'm just going to place it. Then I'm going to go and uh, get the resources for it. And then craft one and then throw it away because it's that would be cheating if <laughs> but you know I'm just gonna do this so that that means they will not they will not despawn um when I leave the, the chunk and because well because the chunks aren't exited if you know what I mean uh, now I'm just gonna go ahead and make some of them I do have some lapis don't I I, I know I have lapis somewhere do I even have iron Oh no. Oh, that may be a small amount of cheating. Um <laughs> it, it's not intentional cheating, it's like 
shooting to save the good of my country. Uh, I probably have some of the stuff in here. Yeah, there's the iron. And lapis. There's some lapis. Okay, good. So I'm just going to go ahead and gonna craft those stuff now. I don't know, it can be four of them, so I can throw one of them. If I throw then one of them away, that will not count as cheating. I'm going to need to do this. I hate these teleporter things. They're so annoying sometimes. There we go. Okay. Um, so I need to smelt these. And I need eight of those. Um, I still haven't actually done anything with the sorting system yet, uh, apart from building it. I haven't actually got it fine-tuned or anything, so I'm going to be doing that fairly soon. Um, I, although next episode, I want to finally get started in some of my magical mods, because I haven't done those yet, and we're like already, what, like episode 11? So, you know, I'd really like to get those got done, done soon. Sorry about my mouse, by the way. It's really annoying. Um, also, what I want to do soon is scrap box of the day. Might as well do that now. Um, because we can. So let's make the scrap box. And obviously we have to go to the shelf to do the scrap box of the day. Well, how would you do it anywhere else? That's just stupid. Uh, so seven, last one. There we go. And uh, we can make these Tesla coil things now. I just said Tesla coil again. Teleport tether. There we go. Okay, so there's four of them, and one of these things gets thrown away. Um, where can I throw it? In lava, I guess. Oh, something. I'll just throw it on the ground. It'll despawn and stay out. There we go. So it wasn't really cheating. Just sort of to get the resources need it so that like I won't need to go through and the whole despawn thing because that'll be annoying if I had to do that. Um okay, let's do scrap box of the day. Boom. Oh another dirt block. Original. I'm getting loads of blocks now, is there like something with that? Like, I had a whole bunch of items now I'm getting a whole bunch of blocks. <laughs> oh well. Um so I know I haven't Real, I, I don't know. I said, I'm thinking I want to end the episode here today because I know I haven't done much, but I, I really like, like I mean, <laughs> you know, I, I think the majority of the episode was taken up by fixing that room there. Um, these are going quite slowly, so I might add some more engines in a more efficient way so that they won't blow up. Um, because I, I really need more power than that. Well, that, that is terrible. I mean, and that's been going since we've we've set them up, which is like a couple of minutes ago. Um, but anyway, so yeah, thanks for watching, and until next time, see ya.